recover from his injuries. Just listening to a harrowing report. Oh dear. So I've had someone spying on me all day. Who's now shut the curtains because I keep flipping the bird out the window. <laughs> Right, Marnie Moo. How are you dogs doing out here now? All good? All clean? Yep. Good boys and girls. Are we... Look at you with your silly ear now. Right, let's see what you reckon then, Marnie Moo. Have we got a little Marnie Moo for uh, Jackson, have we? Cheer him up a bit. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. Get down, get down. <laughs> hey, get down. <laughs> Get down! It's not for you, is it? <coughs> Put that up there on the clean washing until later on. <coughs> oh, what's up with you dogs, eh? What, did you think it was a real dog, did you? Because it was making barking noises. You dumb motherfuckers. Uh, a little miniature Marnie Boo for little Marnie Moo. Mm. Cute, isn't it? It's a bean baggy one, right? <laughs> there you go, that can sit up there. <coughs> Dogs can bark at it every now and then to take their mind off the neighbours. There you go, just a quick video. Just listening to this at the moment. The meaning of a litre of blood. But that wouldn't suit the agenda. There is not a trace of empathy for the public who are worried and sickened at what happened to these so children. So you've you got to and protect your kids if they're getting bullied. If you were against migrants... You know what I mean? ...then you're just far right. I'm surprised the victims themselves have not been called far right at this point. Such is the surreal absurdity... Including Tyler. ...if he's getting bullied. Because that means someone's picking on him knowing that he's... Uh, she never objected to the Yosef His family's uh, not focused on him. So, you know, what we got to do? Many of these people were the migrants she claimed to champion. Meanwhile, radio shock jock Jeremy Dixon is beside himself with excitement. Do you know what I mean? The riots have offered him the type of... What we got to go, bullying the bullies? Because it sounds like it to me. And Twitter is happy to boost the posts of any radical left. But you know what? It's like when uh, the same tweeters you've got uh, supported extremely violent American BLM riots that resulted in mass looting and murders. And more recently, they tested agenda the mothers, masses, if you see what I mean. Not it amid their for the people. I isolate the boy from the father one of them say upset about what to punish the father. But as one person said to me, if the children were from Dalkey, a week of candlelit vigils would ensue. Meanwhile, Twitter and that's what the problem's been. The so it's about time so it's someone stopped being a silly mum over that way. The same platform has been spamming specific Before she ends up losing her kids. Usually posts regarding mass immigration crime. They have been relentlessly targeting posts that are about Ashley Murphy. You know what I'm saying now? In order to ensure the posts and if uh, the system gets its claws into my grandson, oh, I'm going to go absolutely ballistic. So if you were one of those people I referred to at the beginning of this piece, 
because it would have been caused by her right from the beginning. And she's still trying to do it to fucking cause problems. So, you know, it's the oldest trick in the book, divide and rule, and then watch your kids suffer, and then there, there, mummy will sort it out. Mummy's constantly on the phone then to the authorities and whoever will listen to her. But she's doing a good job, and it ain't. It's her that's been the problem all along. Even set up a man, put him in prison, tried to get him called an animal to keep him away from his son. When I knew the truth about it all along. And then the judge threatened my grandson and I thought right okay so now we know what you're up to then you're trying to separate the children from the parents so you can abuse the children you fucking pedo Nazi cunts and it's all coming from the system and the women that support that system thinking they're going to get free money out of the system to help them to put their kids lives right yeah, well, they're paying you for your children so they can get into their children's, into those children's lives. Yeah, so they can either fuck with their heads or fuck with their bodies. Be very careful what you're unleashing over that way in Britain. Because if that occurs... You're going to lose your kids completely. All right? Because that's what the system does. It tries to make out that both sets of parents can't be trusted to bring up the state's property, which they claim as a birth certificate. So once you apply or beg the state to take ownership of the child for a birth certificate they then own that child the same as they own your car if you apply for a license for that car or if you apply for a license for a dog so don't comply do not comply you didn't comply with a covid mask why not so you will comply with a dog muzzle? No, because that's the same as a human mask, isn't it? It's mission creep. Telling you you're slaves, your dogs are slaves. They're all owned by the state, but they're not. The state's just lost the country without realising it for pushing it too far. Have a happy Sunday, folks. Because it's all about to change a bit drastic and a bit quickly now. Um, I've been quiet all week because I've just been sitting back watching my own situation. And unfortunately for them, I caught them all at it. Including the local MP. Authorising the Investigatory Powers Act because someone had been manipulating the situation over the dogs. Yeah, falsely claiming they're aggressive, they're this, they're that, they're going to eat my dog, blah, 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 blah. So the dog got set up, the police complied with it, went along with it. Once they worked out that it was uh, yeah, a bit of manipulation going on, they said, well, if you do this, we'll shut it all down. So I recorded it inside the police station <laughs> as I put my name to something, which uh, you'll hear me discuss it when I actually release that, as if to say, well, you know, if that's what you're saying, yeah, I'm happy to put my name to it. But if you've tricked me in any way, shape or form, as you read it out to me, in your own words that I'm recording, then obviously... You're being devious in your contracts, which breaks common law, and you are therefore corrupt. 
and that contract isn't worth the paper it's written on. So, no, you don't have to wear a mask, dogs. No, you don't have to wear a mask, humans. No, you do not have to comply in a state of lawful, peaceful rebellion. So start standing up for yourselves. Like the lions, you are.